the person, uh, the pedestrian is a politician, a green politician who said something racist about white men and violence and has talked about me. Um, I don't know what, because I don't, I, she's quite insignificant as far as I'm concerned, but, uh, you know, she has a platform in New Zealand. And what she, <laughs> the collision, there's footage, she literally walks out in front of some motorcycles and she gets slightly hit by a handle of a motorcycle as it's going by. But that is kind of what happens if you step into a road. I was asked about my involvement with that woman getting uh, run over, I think they said, or hit by a bike um, when she was crossing. There was something that was said that implied that it was like a deliberate violent act how she was hit by that motorcycle and as if it was my fault. And I just wanted to say this to people of New Zealand. Your media is corrupt. And if you don't, th if you think it's fine because you agree, you agree that I am a hateful person, maybe you agree that I deserve to die that day. Maybe you think that women don't deserve to speak. Maybe you think that women don't deserve to have any liberty or freedom in society. Maybe you do agree that no little girl can grow up and dream of being a sports star because she might get a neck broken on the rugby field by some bloke who thinks he's a woman. Maybe you agree with all that. But let me just tell you, you relinquish your power to the state in such a catastrophic way that when people get elected who disagree with you, you can put your own hands in handcuffs.